Hey guys, Mackie's Mad Sports here. Today I will be opening one select 2021 Footy Stars packet and I'll also be doing my round seven tips. So let's get straight into it. So here we go. For the packet, we have Jack Crisp. Darcy Parrish, Tom Mitchell, and then we have Erin Phillips, and for the holographic, we have Luke Jackson of the Melbourne Demons. Then for the good card, we have, ooh, a game breaker. Of Patrick Dangerfield for Geelong. So as you can see, they've got other players. They've got Brandon Parfit, Joel Selwood, Cameron Guffrey, and Sam Menegola. So that's that's good. I haven't got a game breaker in a bit. Um, but to finish off the packet, we have Nathan Jones. Scott Lysette and Andrew Gaff. So again, I will show you the cards as always. So we have Jack Crisp, Darcy Parrish, Tom Mitchell, Nathan Jones, Scott Lysette, Andrew Gaff, Aaron Phillips. We also have Luke Jackson and Patrick Dangerfield as the cards I got in that pack. Now moving on to my round seven tips. So, to my round seven tips. For the first game, the Tigers and the Dogs at the MCG, I'm going to tip the Western Bulldogs. I think they've been a good team this year. Um, having not lost the game, um, and Richmond um, having lost a few games. Um, but I'm going to tip them by 22 points. So moving on to the next game. Collingwood versus the Suns. Um, I'm going to go with Collingwood here. It's at the MCG. Um, even though um, the Suns beat the Swans by a margin of... Um, 40 points last week and Collingwood lost to Essendon. I still think they um, are going to beat the Suns. Um, my main reason is it's at the MCG as well. So, moving on to the Crows v Giants game at Adelaide Oval. I'm going to go with the Crows. Yeah, it's at Adelaide Oval. Um... And I don't think the Giants have been playing that well um, in the past couple of matches. Um, even though they beat Sydney, um, I still think the Crows come away with the win. So the next match, Saints v Hawthorne at Marvel. I'm going to go with Hawthorne. My, um, I think the Hawks coming off a win against the Crows... Um, that will give them a lot of um, strength. And um, I don't think St. Kilda have been playing that well in the past couple of weeks. So that's one of the reasons why I'm tipping Hawthorne against St. Kilda. Moving on to the next game. Um, the Lions versus Port at the Gabba. I am going to go with Port Adelaide here. Um... So, the Lions haven't been playing that well this year. That's um, a reason why I'm tipping Port. And because Port, in the past couple of rounds, they've been playing um, good. So even though I was at the Gabba, I still think Port have a better chance of winning. So, moving on to the next game. The Swans v the Cats at the SCG. I'm going to go with... An upset here of the Swans. The reason is, um, I uh, it's at the SCG, and um, I don't think the Cats um actually are gonna beat Sydney. Um, but 
my main reason is I don't think Geelong will do good for the rest of the season. So that's one of the reasons why I'm tipping the Swans. And the Swans have been playing good at like Port Adelaide this year. So moving on to the next game. Um, North Melbourne v Melbourne at Bloodstone. I'm going to go Melbourne here. Um, having lost no games and North Melbourne having lost all their games. Um, that's just going to be a massive advantage for Melbourne. And that's just, um, I think it's going to be a big margin by about 40, 50 points. Um, but yeah, I think the D's will definitely come away with the win. So, Essendon v Carlton. I'm going to go Essendon here. Coming off a win against um, Collingwood at, on Antac Day last week. Um, that will definitely give them a boost. And um, I don't think Carlton will be strong enough to defeat Essendon. Um, they're both 2-4. and four, And I, I still think it will be a good clash. But I don't think the Bombers will be able to beat them. I mean, the Blues will be able to beat them. So, the Western Derby is the last match of the round at Optus Stadium. I'm going to go with the West Coast Eagles here for the Western Derby. Um, like most Western Derbies, um, I think the Eagles the Eagles have won um, most of them. So that is a reason why I'm tipping them. Um, and yeah, I just don't think Freeman will be strong enough to defeat the Eagles. So, guys, that is my round seven tips. But I will show you, um, if all my predictions are correct, what the ladder will be like. So, guys, here is what the ladder will be like if I get all the tips correct this week. So, we have Bulldogs in first, Melbourne in second, Bradley in third, Sydney in fourth, Geelong in fifth, Crows in sixth. Fremantle in 7th, West Coast in 8th. Then to finish it off, we have Richmond, Brisbane, Essendon, Hawthorne, Gold Coast, Carlton, Collingwood, GWS, St Kilda, and North Melbourne. So guys, that'll basically wrap it up for this video. Subscribe, and if we can hit 50 subscribers in the next 5 weeks, I will do a very special uh, 50 subscriber special. So let's hit 50 subs in the next five weeks. Um, but anyways, like the video and I'll see you next time. Bye.